what's going on guys dr root 7 signing in back with another tutorial video this is going to be an update about hecate which is the bootloader that we use to load up atmosphere custom firmware so hecate has been updated to the latest version which is version 6.0.0 brings in a variety of changes two most notable features that i'm seeing is android linux booting and payload tools. I guess they're going to integrate this to make the booting of Android and Linux more easier. More information will be provided in the coming days, I guess. But another notable feature that I'm seeing is that no more SD card removals. I've already tried this and tested this, so this works and it makes our lives a little bit more easier, especially for those who don't own a RCM loader. So this is going to be a bit more easy for you guys while trying to update Hecate. Now I don't know if it's going to work for Atmosphere files as well because these are system files and for these to be copied and pasted always the SD cards needs to be removed otherwise you won't be able to transfer the files and there's a load of changes that I can see you guys can go through with it if you want the updating process is pretty straightforward which i'll get to in a bit because it's only going to take a second before moving into that i'll just uh, let you guys know that i'm going to update my repacks and include hecate 6.0 with the latest version of atmosphere firmware and also i guess additionally i will be making another update video so that you guys can stay updated with the latest versions because that's all these tutorials are about. Okay, so I'm already on the latest version of Hecate, which is 6.0.0, as you can see here. Let's just start with the copying and pasting process. So guys, I'm going to be using FTPD, Remote File Transfer Software, the Homebrew software, if you guys wanna know how to use that or install that, you guys can check out my FTPD tutorial. If you don't want, then you can just, you know, plug in your SD card into your PC. So here I am remotely connected to my Switch's SD card. Just download the RAR file from the link and extract the contents. You're, you're going to get this folder, Hikate Creator 6.0. Just go into that folder, copy these files and just paste them. I already have them pasted. Just go ahead and merge them. You don't need to delete any previous files if you want to keep the settings intact. So just replace the files. And there you go. You are all done with updating of Hecate. And there you go. I already showed you guys that we are on the latest version of Hecate before performing the update. Additionally, booting into the atmosphere greatly increased it doesn't take that longer to boot into the custom firmware so that's also an upgrade if you want to upgrade to the latest version of hecate those who are already on the updated atmosphere custom firmware just go ahead and follow this tutorial and uh, for those who are yet to update the whole atmosphere and the switches official firmware can just you know use the repacks from my videos Okay, so that's it for this one. Until next time, Dr. Root 7 signing off. Peace.